bench here and bring the machine down on the bench and then dig further. And, uh, my hope is to get as close to 10 meters as we can get. This test is going to tell us how deep this machine can go. And the second thing is going to tell us whether we have any groundwater in here. This will determine what size we buy for mining. And we're within the perimeters of the 20 meters. It will a 20 meter depth. It's going to show us how deep this size of machine can go without us having to mine. The machine is having no problem to dig this at all. So it's a very effective machine at this depth. In the pit, you see the upper 20 centimeters is the black cotton soil. This is the cover over the top. Beneath that is a stone layer made up of tense gravel is about a meter thick. The test we're doing here can end up saving us up to $100,000 in machine purchase because we don't need a larger machine at the way it looks, the way this is performing. This is a woman that taking the quartz fragment, which I've got. This is a quartz fragment from the Kuruvim horizon, from the pit. We started on, on, on the bench that he's going to come down onto. We're going down onto the second bench now and he's going to take as much as he can and dump it over to that side. When that is too full, he will start dumping on the side we are standing. We're sitting down on the second bench now with the machine, and uh, he's going to go as deep as he can from here. And uh, after that, he'll have to retreat. What we're looking at here, it's the end of the rainy season, and this hole is dry. bottom of the pit here, and this is at 8.5 meters. Uh, this is the rock. You can see that it's, uh, it's very friable, easy to be broken up, very weathered granite. It still supports a vertical wall. It still, as you can see, the walls are vertical. So that certainly will have a big influence on the pit design. The reason for this is to see that we can get down there and to see whether or not we need to keep the pit wall <laughs> narrow or wide. And we can obviously see because of the vertical, the way the wall stands safely directly, we can get away much narrower. The best uh, conditions for small scale mining is we. Uh, we don't want to move any more waste than we have to. Waste costs money to move, and it doesn't make us anything. So uh, if we can keep the pit narrow, and uh, this proves that we can, we uh, will uh, be money ahead. Re reconstruction, reclamation work, we're money ahead. Okay, it's around about 5 o'clock in the evening now. 